Hey, happy Ireland day. <laughs> yeah. So I, uh, I actually went to my buddy, uh, my buddy and his wife own a gym and they're doing like a powerlifting meet today. So I went up there and watched some people squat and it was pretty intense. It's pretty crazy. Definitely more weight than I can lift. <laughs> uh, but it's only 10.30 now. I just left and it's only 10.30. And I figured um, on my way home, it's Saturday. So I might as well try to hit some garage sales. So I saw, I saw a sign going into this neighborhood and I'm just looking for the garage sale now. I think it might have been down there. So yeah, I'm going to go hit some garage sales. Hopefully you all enjoy today's video. If you do, hit the thumbs up button and consider subscribing. Let's go see if we can find some cool stuff today. Morning. Morning, how are you? How are you doing? Good. Are you looking for anything specific today? Or just, nope. just I was just on browsing. my way home and I was like, garage sale. Gotcha, okay. You came to buy it all? Take it all. Oh. <laughs> First one, nothing there. Let's try to count how many I can go to today and see see how much stuff I get, if anything. <laughs> this is one of those hard decisions. Which way do I go? There's one right and left. Let's go right first. How much is the little jacket? It's a dollar. A dollar. And those? Yeah, a dollar. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much all is a dollar. Okay. Your hangers back. Oh, oh thank you. Of course. <laughs> I appreciate that. Yes. <laughs> I've been telling them all day, don't give away my don't, hangers. I know. I don't even pay attention to it. <laughs> when you when you don't need them you need them yard sale number two first buy so far that was a success i got a cool pair of kids carhartt overalls and a really really nice like columbia deep pile kids jacket and i paid a dollar a piece two bucks score nice one 10 44 a.m and we're at yard sale number three How much are these shoes? How much are the shoes? Two dollars. Two? Okay. So how come you were in Africa? Now that it is any of my business? I was just born there. That's where my family's from. From, really? from South Africa. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And how come you here? 
Uh, we just moved to Texas for oh. a better life. Yeah. <laughs> I've, I've been in America since I was five okay. years old. So. Yeah. It's like everybody comes and wants a better life, but right now the life ain't looking so great. Right? right? <laughs> Things so. change, thank you. And where did you like it better, Texas or Florida? You know, when I was a kid, I didn't really like Texas. Mm -hmm. So I like Florida more as a kid, but mm -hmm. now I think like, I would rather yeah, go back to Texas. Really? Yeah. Well, my husband is from Texas. So yeah. I didn't like it, but I'm from Europe. So for me, I, I like it, sure. everything closer, a little bit more European, sure. what's happening yeah. here. Yeah, 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 yeah. But Texas is more peaceful. It is, but yeah. But so long you don't live on the border right now. I know, I know. I like um, Austin. Austin. I like the city. Austin, yeah. Yeah. I like I yeah. uh, San Antonio. San Antonio is cool. Yes, yeah. I like Alpha But it's, it's very spread out. Yes, Everything's very yeah. spread out. Yes, yeah. Have a good day, ladies. Thank you. Nice Thank to meet you. you. Bye. Okay, yard sale number three. Bought a couple more things and met, met a couple really nice ladies. Very, very sweet. Um, I bought a... Actually, I thought it was a t-shirt when I picked it up. It's actually like a sleeveless, sleeveless shirt. But it is new with tags and it is vintage. And it is what's called a center check. Nike embroidered a little center check. If you could find the hoodies, they go for a lot of money. The cutoff short sleeve, I don't know, but for $2 new with tags, grabbed it. And then I picked up a pair of shoes. I think they're Jeep brand shoes, J41, J-41. Minimalist barefoot shoes. New with tags as well for $2. I don't know what they sell for, probably like 30, 40 bucks. So yeah, nice little, nice little stop. That was number three. Let's see if we can find some more. 11.02 AM and we are at yard sale number four. Good, how are you? Iris. Yes. I'm Iris. I'm the party animal. I'm very Irish. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Kilpatrick, so I'm Oh, nice. Anyway. Ma'am, can I ask you a question? Yes, yes. So, uh, my wife collects this stuff, so I figured okay. might as well get it for her. Right. Um, this comes out to, without these, uh -huh. comes out to $12. Okay. Would you do 10 Would you do 10 for all this? Instead of 12 yeah. Instead cool. of 12 Yeah. There's a 10. Right. Thank you so much. She's going to be very happy. Do you need a box? I would love a box if you have one. Yeah. yeah. That is not a lie, by the way. Allie does actually collect those. She's, when we moved to the new house, she has like, oh my gosh, 20 plus of those little, those little items. Sirocco, I think is what they're called. And she's going to do like a whole room setting with them. So for 10 bucks for all that stuff, I figure that's the least I can do. Because Allie's not here with me today. She's at a friend's bachelorette party. So I figured I'd buy her a little gift. <laughs> what a what a nice husband I am. 11.14 <laughs> a.m. And this should be yard sale number five. Okay. Five bucks. Cool. Guys, not the world industry's bucket hat. Oh my goodness, <laughs> there's some childhood right there. I can't pull off bucket hats, so I'll probably sell this one. The snap-on, I'm gonna see if my brother-in-law, Vince, wants it. If he doesn't, then I'll sell it. Still a good hat, Richardson. Richardson, Richardson snapback. I just noticed there's a little chunk out of the snap. <laughs> okay, well, hopefully he wants it then, because I can't really sell it. <laughs> But this one, let's go. 11.29 a.m., yard sale number six. Looks like it could be a pretty good one. Let's go find out. She's looking at these things behind me. I felt like she's looking at me right now. These are neat. You see them chairs out there too? Oh, we're almost the maid down. Those are pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. 
It's Carhartt. Did you get them at the park? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Oh, they're so cool. Yeah. You said they're five bucks? Yeah. Okay. Ooh. How much are the pants, the kids' pants? $1. Can I leave some stuff over yeah, with you? Just leave right here. I'm gonna grab these as well. Oh, yeah. We're down to $1. Oh, were you? Okay. They're great. He never wore them though. Nah. <laughs> here, what can I get for ten bucks? How about that? Keep you in business. Just give me, give me one donut. Give me one donut. Oh no, you can, have, you can have lemonade donuts. I just want a single donut. Esther, do you want lemonade? Here you go. Awesome. Those look good. Give your sister some of that money though. <laughs> No, 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 no. Let him. He's hustling. Uh, mm hmm. Exactly. That's a good donut. Thank you. Of course. Thank you, you so much. It was the best donut I've had all day. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. That's serious inflation. That's it, right? Well, he was hustling. He didn't want, yeah, he didn't want to go out of he business. He said 20 bucks. I had to work him down at 10. Did he? <laughs> no, I'm just <laughs> You guys have a good day. Thank, Thank you. you. Fun sale. I got a donut for $10. Delicious. And I got a pair of kids' Carhartt pants. And four, four Disney popcorn buckets for 20 bucks. Well, I guess 30 bucks with the donut, but... Those popcorn buckets are really, really nice. Here's a fun fact you probably don't care about. So when I was uh, when I was in high school, I went to high school about one and a half miles away from right here. And how I know that is because when I wrestled every day before practice, we would run this road and we would end up here and then turn around and go back. And this was all orange groves. So there were like a whole bunch of trees right here. And we used to jump over the fence and steal oranges. Am I proud of that? Not really. <laughs> Shouldn't steal. Stealing's bad, kids. But those oranges were delicious. And now there's no field there. That makes me kind of sad. Took me a little while to find the next one, driving around. It is 12.06 p.m. And yard sale, I believe that's number seven. Yard sale number seven is right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Gentlemen today. Great, how are you? Good. Been busy? Uh, off and on, you know how it That's is. How like, it goes. Everybody comes in bunch That's and right. then nobody comes and then everybody comes. That but is that's exactly good. how it is. It's just time to rest. <laughs> you don't have any older clothing, do you? No. I like old t shirts. <laughs> uh, I had some in this, in this box. Like this box. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go. I don't think anything we've got fits you. No. no. All right. No, that's all underwear. No. I think I had two or three in here and they're gone. All righty. Okay. I appreciate it. Have a great yeah, day. You too. Thank, Thank you. you. Nada at lucky number seven. Let's, uh, I'd like to at least, at least at 10. So I'm 15 minutes away from home. I'm going to put in my home address. And hopefully there's three more on the way. 20 minutes later. Well, there were no more garage sales on the way home, but, but I do have to pass the post office and I have a package waiting for me there. That's pretty cool. Just like that car that just drove by. <laughs> um, let me pick up this package and show you what it is. I was wrong. I actually have a whole ton of mail that I just picked up. Some gem gems. I've been buying a lot lately. Let's go through, uh, let's go through the mail. If you guys want to skip this part of the video, I totally understand. I know not everybody is into vintage t-shirts and that's what's in the boxes, <laughs> vintage t-shirts. So if you want to see some really cool vintage t-shirts, I'm going to, I'm going to go through my mail. And if you don't, then I appreciate you watching today's video. Thank you so much. Found some cool stuff today and, uh, make sure to subscribe for more.
appreciate you guys. We ran into the garage because we were looking for Allie. Oh, mom's not here right now. I'm sorry, girls. I'm sorry. I know. I got all this other mail, but this is actually the package that I wanted to open first, the one that I was going to show you because I bought this on eBay, which I don't usually buy stuff on eBay, but I feel like I feel like I got a pretty good deal on this. I want it at auction. It's definitely not going to fit me, but look how cool this is, guys. This is one of the rarest ones I think I've ever had. Let's see here. We got size medium Hanes tag. Look at this thing. This is a dated 1984 Ed Culver Red Hot Chili Pepper shirt. So this is a photo that was taken at the show, then printed on this shirt. I'll pop up what I paid for it, which I think is a pretty good deal. Looks good to me. Looks good to me. And you might ask why I would buy a shirt that doesn't fit me. And the answer is I have a little wife and she can wear smaller shirts. So sometimes like this, this is the other one that I bought. This is the uh, OG Red Hot Chili Pepper shirt. Sometimes I buy shirts just because I like when Allie wears them. Her collection is actually better than mine at this point. Uh, all right, let's, uh, let's see what we got here. I'll start with this package. This came from Faded Show on Whatnot. Shout out Ryan. Uh, shout out Jess, shout out the Faded Show team, Longston. They do a great job, guys. If you want like higher end vintage for good prices, I will definitely check out their show. It's called Faded Show and they only do whatnot. It's really cool. Okay. So this pack is from Faded. Let's see what we got. Oh, so I'm in this like weird mood where I, uh, I love vintage coffee shirts right now. So I've been collecting coffee shirts. <laughs> I saw this one pop up, my size. It says Boyd Coffee Espresso Thyself with this like art print. I don't know, I think it's awesome. I love coffee teas. If anybody has any like unique coffee shirts, hit me up because I'll buy them. And then this went up for a really, really good price. Single stitch, Grateful Dead, Spiral, Skeletons, Dancing Skeletons classic one and then i have this shirt and i've never seen someone sell it before so i was like well i might as well double up maybe i can wear it and sell it uh, this one looks like it'll probably fit me bigger than the one that i have but such a cool piece jump into some of these boxes Let's see what we got if i remember what i paid i'll tell you but if i don't i apologize i gotta look it up pretty much all of this stuff except for the personal stuff that i bought pretty much all of this stuff will end up on our whatnot channel so if you go to whatnot if you download the app which i'll leave a link in the description of today's video that if you haven't signed up for whatnot yet you get 15 bucks by clicking on that link and then if you just go to whatnot and type in rally roots we should pop up first just gonna take the shirts out the box and do that on the giant xl tag aerosmith Air Force one we've got a really nicely faded size extra large black crows with the world tour back hit oh i love this one this is a size extra large good xl too you got the wacky racing cartoon network front and back i think this is 99 is that right 97 1997 got the black cat on the 90s fruit of the loom tag i'm an idiot this is a blues traveler shirt not just a black cat licensed right there blues traveler 1996 indiana jones on that old 80s 80s early 90s disney tag beautiful piece and then look at this one this is on a size large toltex tag taz Taz, the wild thing, Taz, where he's like destroying the piano. That's amazing. I love that. And then we have a vintage Looney Tunes. This is definitely like a bootleg ripoff, but it is 90s, single stitch. <laughs> Pretty funny. I don't know what those characters would be called. You guys let me know, what are their names? Name them in the comments. What are the bootleg Looney Tunes characters' names? And then this is a Grateful Dead Lot t-shirt. Parking Lot t-shirt, size extra large. The cat in the hat. Wow, it's a nice big print too, actually. Nice big, big print, cat in the hat on a beautiful tie-dye tee. That's it for that box. Let's break into the next one. Two more. Also, shout out my dad for getting me this knife. It's very sharp. Nice little wolf piece. 100 years, one hell of a party. Little uh, Harley Davidson, I guess. 
Yeah, a little Harley Davidson 2003. This is another Harley shirt, size extra large, Sturgis, 1999 Sturgis piece. Size large on the Motley Crew. I think this is 2000s as well. Yeah, 2005 Red, White, and Crew. Same thing, size large, another Motley Crew. 2006 on this one. And then last but not least on the 90s All Sport tag, little Kiss kiss piece with the sleeve hit as well nice kiss piece last box this is definitely going to be my favorite box i already know i remember buying this lot so here we go great packaging by the way with the cardboard on top so you don't slice the tees so this is a i believe mostly tie-dye shirt box and i paid i think i paid 1250 I believe that's what I paid. It might've been 1200. It might've been 1200. Maybe I paid 1200. Okay, let's get into it though. <laughs> On the, what are you? No tag, but single stitch, classic gems. This is a liquid blueprint, size 2XL. This is one of the greatest Joey Mars pieces. You guys know I love Joey Mars artwork. This is a beautiful 90s underwater ocean Joey Mars piece. Size large again, 90s. Jerry Garcia band long sleeve. You don't see this one long sleeve very often. Size extra large, further festival. This is 1996. Really cool further festival shirt. Almost like that rat fink graphic on the front. Uh, size extra large. We've got the Almond Brothers band summer tour 1997 with the cool back hit as well. Ooh, here's a piece size extra large white liquid blue tag. The Yoda, Star Wars, really cool one. Size extra large, looks like another Almond Brothers piece. Front and back, this is the peach and the watermelon one, 1995. Another Almond Brothers band on the white liquid blue tag. This one's cool. Front and back, I love the, I love the mushroom prints on the Almond Brothers band shirts. This is a size extra large liquid blue, and you've got another Jerry Garcia band. Sure. There's some good nature tees in here as well. Size large, white liquid blue, 90s tag. The elephant, another underwater scene. The dolphins, the whales, 90s. White liquid blue, 90s, another nature print. Allie loves nature tees, so I know when she sees this box, she's gonna be like, what? You gotta keep all those. <laughs> Gray tag, liquid blue on this one. You got the SeaWorld. SeaWorld front and back. Another one of those. Oh, here we go. Liquid blue, the Beatles. The Beatles yellow submarine tie-dye. Another white liquid blue tag, aquarium. Another white liquid blue tag. Nature, dolphins. This one's like dead stock. Ooh, classic one, white liquid blue tag. You got the lion with the Africa back hit. Shout out Africa, that's where I'm from. 90s Grateful Dead Spring Tour. Good size on this one. 90s I Die. Oh, this is a 2002 Grateful Dead. The other ones. Long sleeve. Very nice. Peter Forth's Grateful Dead design. I think this is like 99, 98, 95. You got the liquid blue Egypt piece, single stitch. This one's really cool. White tag. This is like all the nature scenes really clean i had this shirt and it was like super super ripped up and torn this one's really good condition another cool grateful dead piece you got the like magician card trick one classic one here you got the uh 1990 los angeles and then we also have the long sleeve version of that magician card player one liquid blue gray tag another is it grateful dead grateful dead-esque I'm not sure if it is Grateful Dead, but cool graphic. Random tie-dye rush piece, size large. I actually do like this one, 2002. 2002 Rush Vapor, like parking lot bootleg shirt. Liquid blue, pink Floyd, dark side of the moon, long sleeve tie-dye, great wear on this. We got the Jimmy, Jimi Hendrix, single stitch. And then last one in here, gray liquid blue, You've got the Jim Morrison, the doors. This is a beautiful long sleeve, great wear as well. So there you go. That is everything I got in the mail today. Pretty nice little mail day. 
Again, if you made it this far in the video, I appreciate it. Please subscribe and we will see you on the next one. I'm Ryan Roots. Later everyone. Bye. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. You guys are awesome.